I don't know if you know this, but I wanted to make you aware. George Bush is a communist. I mean, he's nationalized more companies, private companies, than Hugo Chavez has, as far as I know. Certainly in greater in, uh, wealth those companies are than the ones that Hugo Chavez nationalized. Uh, right now, America might have more nationalized private companies. Well, they're no longer public. They've been nationalized by George W. Bush, the communist, <laughs> than uh, Russia does. It's unbelievable. You think I'm kidding? I'm not kidding. He uh, just nationalized a couple of weeks ago Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae. They're gigantic. The, uh, their effect on the economy is valued at about a trillion dollars. Okay. Now that's not their net effect, not their net value necessarily, but their effect on the economy. And he just uh, put out an eighty-five billion dollar loan to bail out AIG, the largest insurer. And it's not just a bailout. We bought AIG as the taxpayers. Congratulations, you're now the proud owner of AIG. Uh, the American taxpayer now owns 80%. To be accurate, 79.9% .9 of AIG. We are the majority shareholder. Now, I don't know what we're going to do with it, <laughs> but we bought it. That's what communists do. They take industries over for the government. I mean, look it up in the dictionary. Correct me if I'm wrong. This is not a reasonable position. This is a far more communist position, where you just come in and you go nationalized. Okay, I just I take that company over for the U.S. government. That's what we've done. We've taken 80% of that company for the U.S. government. Welcome to the new communism of the Republicans.